Happy Father's Day from Dos Amigos. To all fathers, every father, except for the, the ones with the shit hearts. Yeah. Fuck those dads. Yeah, so they can't see light. That's the thing. So, yeah, since we figured, you know, Joel, uh, uh, Joel's daughter was murdered, it would be the best Father's Day game. Yeah, he's, and he's, he's just, he's such a dad. Yeah. You know, the dadliest of all dad men. Look at him go. My goodness, wow. They're ravaging that, that, that corpse. Should I fight him or, uh, just keep, keep going? Just, uh, snook past him. Okay. Well... I told Tyler that I wouldn't talk about my trip to him until now, so... It's time. You're <laughs> gone for quite some time. And it's funny, because, like, this episode's going up on Father's Day, which is, like, this Sunday, but Donnie and I were talking about you being away in episodes that are not going up until, like, <laughs> the end of the month. Uh, just a little funny tidbit here. Um, like, I, I remember playing this game, and... I went down here and I was like, okay, I'm good, right? If you start making any noise here, they will still follow you. So, wow, really? Yeah. That's you gotta get, you gotta get far as hell. Like she's still running and shit, but if you yeah. if you make enough noise, like you shoot a gun or something. I did it just to tease them, and then they actually came after me, and I was like, <laughs> shit. But yeah. So I guess technically it started Saturday. And Saturday, I woke up screaming and crying from a nightmare uh, because we were watching Hannibal the night before. I'm sorry. And I want to... Not Hannibal the movie that Anthony Hopkins was in. Hannibal the television show that is horrifying visually. I I didn't think it would fuck me up, but I guess it's like psychologically... It's what it's supposed to do to you. Yeah. So, like... I'm sorry, though. I did not... That was not my intention. Yeah, but, um, yeah, Mira just, like, had to, like, comfort me for a good, like, five minutes, because I was just freaking the fuck out. But, um, yeah, so... Oh, wait. And you had another dream, apparently, that freaked you out? Yeah, I had... And and then two days after that, like, on the trip, I had a dream where three different people died, and it was three different dreams. And the first dream was that you died. (laughs) So... I did. Those were the two things I did tell you about, but um, you didn't tell me how though. Yeah, I, I like it wasn't really explained. Like I came home to this house and you were like in the shower, just like and your heart wasn't beating. What? Yeah, and you were like it was. We were only like a little bit older than we are now. <laughs> yeah, and I was just like freaking out. I'm like, what happened? What happened? And like, like. Donnie doesn't know what's happening. Mira doesn't know what's happening. Like, <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> yeah. Um, the other two people, it doesn't really matter. Because, I mean, it's not people that I personally even, like, talk to. It's just people I know they exist. Mm-hmm. Um, so it was all people of, like, varying, like, relationships. And it was, like, one of those dreams that just last, like, like, last, like, so like like it's just like so many things will happen over like such a long span of time yeah right? yeah i guess it might have been dreams within dreams because i had multiple dreams yeah and they were all based around the same thing well the other dream it wasn't like i found the person dead it was almost like those like crime shows where you get to see how the person dies mm-hmm. with like different camera angles and shit so like yeah um but that i don't remember the third one that's that's another weird thing. I kept having nightmares, but like, I like, I can't like remember a lot of them. I can't remember the one I had because of Hannibal. But okay, um, yeah. Other than that, uh, it was a really fun trip. It, it, I, we had a really good time. Besides the fact that like I got like the worst sleep. I was just exhausted the whole time, mm-hmm. and all I wanted to do was sleep. I felt bad, <laughs> but uh. Other than that, it was all good. I'm just waiting for this dude to open the door. Uh, Anything specific that uh, is worth 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 chatting about, worth sharing? Um. Oh yeah. Speaking I mean, of sleep and shit, there was a. Uh, <laughs> uh, Mira was talking in her sleep one of the nights. I don't remember quite when, but uh, you touch it, you buy it. Anyway, <laughs> I've played this game a lot. Anyway, uh, 
she was talking in her sleep and the only thing I remember her saying was like she turned to me and was and said we need to talk and I was like about what and she was like what and I'm like about what and she was like no what did I say and I said and I was like I you said that you we need to talk and she was like about what and I was like that's what I said <laughs> so like after it just like went in circles I just gave up on her wow yeah <laughs> <laughs> that's really funny yeah oh and uh i don't think i've shown you the pictures yet but no, um not. we uh we went we went to my dad's work and there's like this little area where they just let um birds and deer roam free and we got to feed like peacocks and deer and wow. pigeons and that's super awesome and ducks yeah and um one of the most interesting ones was we named Afro Duck. Uh, we would put up Afro Duck. <laughs> you took a picture of it? Yeah, I okay, took a cool. picture. I took many pictures of Afro Duck. But, um, yeah, it's, it's this duck, and he looks like he has, like, a white Afro on top of his head. It's, like, a small little Afro-looking <laughs> thing. And it's real. Like, that's just what he looks like. That's and brilliant. He, and he hopples, and he, like, walks sideways, <laughs> and, like... When he went to eat, he would like not look at you, and then and then turn his beak to like eat out of your hand. He was like such a spaz, and he was. You did could tell he was special. Did you get any video of Afro Duck? I didn't get any video, oh, damn. but I did get pictures, plenty the of pictures, pictures. Worked as well. Yeah, and Mira also got like three peacock feathers that were on the ground. She just nice. like found them. Oh, and also one of the deer. Like we got like these two bags of bird feed, and uh, hold on, let me. Uh, Oh, bitch. Nice. Yeah. Tess can use you, actually. But Tess is just fucking... Yeah, Tess usually can take care of these guys if you wait long enough. Damn it. Did I get him? him? Yeah. That wasn't a headshot, but... That was close enough. But yeah, uh, one of the deer... Uh, we we had we had these two bags of just bird feed and the deer were liking the the bird feed so much so that one of them started just eating out of the bag. <laughs> <laughs> so that was pretty funny. Uh, we did so much shit too. Like we got a lot of stuff done. It was Mira's first time ever being out of state besides like something church related. Like she wow. went to like Georgia one time and it was like a church trip sort of thing. And it was the first time being on a plane, mm-hmm. which was uh, she. She actually likes flying. It's just landing that makes her makes her anxious, which mm-hmm. I understand because there's like a bump. Yeah, <laughs> I'm trying to think if there's if there's anything else. Um, um, how's your mom's health? Uh oh yeah, so I think I might have already explained this to you, but I'll explain it for the show. Um, I. I called my mom, like, right before I got on the plane to Texas. And I'm like, hey, I'm coming. Uh, what day you want to see me? And, like, the whole time I'm trying to have a conversation with her, she's just puking. Oh. Yeah. You didn't tell me about that. Yeah. So, like, she's like, yeah, I'm not feeling well. I'm going to try my best to see you, but um, I can't guarantee anything. Um, and it, she ended up not being able to to see me. Oh, shit. But I did get to see uh, my sister. Okay, cool. Um. And you know her her husband. I guess mm-hmm. you could say my brother in law. Uh, I saw I saw a bunch of. That's family. so weird to think. Yeah. <laughs> fucking just strangle this guy. That's what I really liked about this game. They made it fucking grim. Mm-hmm. It is a like uh, you feel the weight of. There's he, he dropped ammo. Oh okay. Yeah, this this game is filled with despair. That Oops. much is for certain. Okay, I think I'm just gonna. I know there's other guys, but it's still like crazy to me. Like I'm pretty sure that same night that uh, you you dreamed about me dying. I had a dream that you, Donnie, and and Lyle were all in. Oh, Mira's beating. Uh, uh, sorry, if why did I say Mira? <laughs> Tess. Mira will beat a bitch. Yeah. I think she took care of him. Yeah, I don't like remember anything specific. I think we were in Europe somewhere, just kind of like driving around. The only reason I think it was in Europe is because we were, like, driving on the left side and, like, everything was mirrored. Super yeah. weird. Oh, what did he drop? A pendant. Oh, warehouse key. A key. 
Um, Treasure. <laughs> yeah, I can't really think. I think I might have. Yeah, I got a new phone, and I think I might have written what I wanted to talk about on the phone, but that's just gone now. <laughs> oh. Yeah, but I, I know those were, uh, the couple things I mentioned were stuff I wanted to talk about. Cool, 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 cool. I'm glad you had a good time. Yeah, and definitely. got out of fucking Florida for, you know, a good week. <laughs> I'm waiting for this guy. What I usually do. I was an absolute mess without you. You were? Yeah, absolutely. Why? Complete and total. I just didn't know what to do with myself. You're like, Patrick, like, what do you yeah. do while I'm gone? Wait for you to get back. That's exactly what it was. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. See, usually he turns around, but I guess I'll just... But Why aren't you using your mad stealth skills? I am. I guess you're doing pretty all right with that. Nobody saw me. Good point. The ending, the like that last bit you have to do in the game with like those heavily armored assholes. <sighs> that shit was it took me fucking forever. Yeah, I, I think, just stopped playing it for a day. Is how long, how hard that shit was. Thankfully, with games like this, I'm like a complete fucking hoarder. So mm-hmm. like, I don't, I don't like you. I didn't use a lot of my equipment. So I was just like, I had like every single fucking weapon just fully loaded, ready to go. Nice. I had to stealth my way through it. I didn't have a choice. I had like yeah. I, I had I, I think I may may have managed to get like a gun from one guy at one point, but I, I don't know. I don't really remember. I remember I haven't played this since it came out on PS3. So I'm like actually pretty excited as for do an actual playthrough left behind. I don't know if we're gonna play the game as a whole. Probably not. Yeah, probably just I do this. Are you gonna stick that bottle up his butt? No. Oh, okay. I'm just gonna <laughs> strangle him. Oh, oh shit. shit, shit. I don't think they're gonna see you. Oh my god, they didn't see me. That's great. What the fuck? I usually always get caught at this part, so mm-hmm. I might just accept my fate. And. Unless I throw a bottle and distract them, but it's two dudes. Yeah. So unless, like. It's not like the. I can't, like, get Tess to coordinate with me. Yeah. So. You got him. I know there's like two other dudes, I think. Two other Jabronis. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Are they waiting to ambush me? Mm. That might be the case. Yeah, I think they want you to come up there. Nice. You gotta fist them, dude. Oh, yeah. Oh! Oh, that was a rough fisting. Fucking, yeah. That makes my titties hard. <laughs> was that it? Whoa! No, that was not. Oh, shit. I can't tell where that's coming from though. Right there. Oh. Ow! Oh man, you can't you can't do that. When you're up close, you gotta fist. <laughs> yeah. Come on now. Fight like a man. Yeah, don't be a puddin'. <laughs> that kind of hurt him. <laughs> it's like, oh shit, I got shot in the arm. I that I like that little bit of realism though. Yeah. Is it like, oh, I got shot in the fucking face. I'm gonna go ahead and fight this guy anyways. I mean, yeah. I know that'll happen in this game, but still. Yeah, because you can get like blown on his face and stuff. Um, God, I can't think if there's anything else about the trip. Um, uh, oh, we ate a fucking colonial kitchen sink. Uh, if you don't know what that is, like, look it up. I don't know what it is. Please tell me. It's, there's, you might have actually told me about this. There's kind of like this, it's a restaurant, but they do like a lot of like cool dessert stuff. Mm -hmm. It's a place called Colonial Cafe. And they have something called the kitchen sink, which is like, it's just huge thing with six scoops of ice cream, two whole bananas, uh, whipped cream and cherry on top. And Mira and I ate it all. God damn. It's, it's considered a feat for like two people to finish it, let alone one person. Wow. And it was, I think it was, apparently it was a man versus food thing. Or he, he, like, it was a challenge that he oh, did. okay, cool. So, like, keep in mind, that's how big this fucking thing is. Did you, like, your face as a name on a wall or something for doing it? No, they just gave us a sticker for doing it. Oh. They're supposed to give you, like, a shirt, too, but they ran out of shirts. Oh, so you just got the sticker. Yeah. That's some fucking bullshit. And people, like, were applauding us when we were, like, leaving the restaurant. Oh. <laughs> you would think if it's something that is a feat, they would have had their shirts around. Yeah. 
I mean, maybe it's a feat that happens like every fucking day. Yeah, I suppose. Something a lot of people try to do. Yeah. You succeeded though. Great job. I yeah. Could, I wouldn't have been able to do that. And you get to like choose like the scoops too. I mean, oh, cool. usually it just comes like strawberry, vanilla, chocolate. You mm -hmm. know, like the standard Neapolitan shit. But yeah. like you can choose whatever. Like Mira had cinnamon on her side, and mm -hmm. I had a, a mint chocolate chip on my side. Naturally. Where are these bitches? I can see uh, a glimpse of a bitch. Yeah. You gotta like upgrade this shit to actually like be able to see anything. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I didn't uh, really do much while you were gone. Uh, I, uh, Didn't you record some shit with Donnie? Uh, a little bit. We And we saw the lobster, which I've already talked about in depth on our uh, multiple times oh, yeah. while we were playing Tokyo Jungle. Um, yeah, and you told me a little bit about it, too. Yeah, it's uh, it was an interesting little film. It was just kind of like a... That was really close. A weird satire on like marriage and relationships and shit. I'm hoping one of them Get just him. looks. Yeah. Yeah, now you can fist this man. Go around this way. A prime fisting for this man. What? what? I didn't mean to do that. What? Ow. Man. Oh, shit. They were all ready for it. <laughs> I'm just gonna fist everybody! Oh shit, you better... Is she gonna fist him? I guess, I'm just gonna let them do their thing! What about the other dude on the other end who just shot it? Who's shooting? Who's uh, shooting I'm trying to think of another... Weapons? I'm trying to think of another way to approach him. I don't think he saw you. So you could get up Where close is he? and fist him. He's on the other end. Right there. Oh. There's two. Yeah. He didn't see me. I think t Tess took care of... Oh my god. You can get him. Yeah, I got him. <laughs> They're like teleport. Yeah. Yeah, thanks for teleporting out of nowhere. Nice. <laughs> a, a prime fisting. A great yeah, fisting. Yeah, so much fisting. Yeah. Uh, it, I usually handle this part a lot better, but fuck it. It bothers me so much that that uh ellie has like a pocket knife and everything and joel is just too fucking dumb to just carry a knife on him yeah you know that's the, that's like one of those like mechanic things it's just like i mean come on guys it's, it's like uh, ellie has that it's just like unlimited knife and he yeah. always has to make like new shivs how hard are you penetrating these dudes go fuck yourself go get him go get him go kick his balls oh yeah i'm gonna kick him right in the balls Prime fisting for him too. Mm-hmm. Well, that's that isn't his fate, but you know. Uh yeah. Uh, uh, I know. Spoilers. Uh, I know. I'm, I'm, I play The Last of Us too. Should I show the scene or go for it? I don't give a fuck. All right. I guess we'll end it with this guy getting fucking blasted in the face. Gonna get face blasted, dude. Look at him. He he looks like uh. You heard feelings, right? He looks like he used to be a hunk, and now he's like a hunk reject. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> they want their uh, weaponries. Yeah. What if their guns aren't guns? It's like a weird code for something. Yeah, it's like, oh, uh, he, he forgot our gum. Yeah. But they call it guns. <laughs> Because M's don't exist in this world. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. I forget they, like, hello him and then kill him. Yeah. Hello, Nister, uh... <laughs> <laughs> Nister and Nissus. Joel. Joel, 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 Joel. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, N, O, P. <laughs> <laughs> Nop. <laughs> Fireflies. Uh, fucking the fireflies. I gave them to the fly flies. Fly uh, flies. Uh, ah, come on. Let's band together. Come on. Oh, God. Shit. Fucking brutal. 
Yeah. You know, oh yeah. And I did. Uh, I was a, a little disappointed when I glanced through our uh, game collection and realized we didn't have GTA 4 on PS3. Oh, another story that Mira like keeps on bringing up to everybody. She starts it off by David yelled at me during the trip, and I did. I said one word. Oh, I think I remember. That yeah. Song. So we had to be up at seven in the morning mm-hmm. to go and have breakfast with my grandpa at like seven thirty, and oh fucking face blasted we'll keep going though um so i can tell the story and i'm not a morning person i'm very cranky Um, we're all very well aware of that david (laughs) i'm very cranky and and i i tend to take it out on people but i i tend to hold back if it's someone i love like mira so this is not nearly as bad as it could have went um so She's, like, constantly trying to wake me up. I was like, 10 more minutes, so I slept another 10 minutes. And she's, like, kept trying to wake me up again, like, all over me, and I'm just not in the mood. And I, so finally, I, she's like, come on, come on. And I go, fine! And I fucking get up. I didn't say it that hard. I was just like, fine! And I fucking just got up and didn't say anything to her for, like, the next, like, three or four hours. Oh, shit. Yeah. I had to, like, cool off in my own way. Yeah, I kind of... I get that. I, I I tend to have a quiet anger when I'm tired. Yeah. I've learned to, like, keep it bottled up because I don't think anyone deserves of, like, me freaking out on them just because of, they're waking me up early. Mm-hmm. But whatever. All right, next time on... Uh, holy shit, we fucked up big time. Did we introduce ourselves as the Friendship Express? No, I said Happy Father's Day. Oh, yeah. Oh, maybe from I the Friendship Express, I said. Technically, I mean, yeah, that's true, but technically it's Dos Amigos. Yeah. Shit. Well, next I can, time I on... I can censor it. Next time on Dos Amigos... Yeah, well, we, we it's so irregular, though. Whenever are we Dos Amigos? <laughs> <laughs> that's what I'm wondering. What? Hey, whoa, hey, whoa, hey, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Like right past her, and she doesn't doesn't even phase her. Yeah. All right. Next time on the friends, uh, the Dos Amigos Express. <laughs> Amigos Express. There you go.